Engineer Adnan Seferini office actually was uh, has started in 1968 in Dubai. Now almost 43 years have passed on the starting of this office. This office actually can do design, supervision, project management, and other activities. We have done so many types of projects, almost all types of projects, from small villas to factories to sheds, schools, universities, high-rise buildings, low-rise buildings, and even hospitals, which we have started recently during the last five years. Uh, after the last recession which happened in 2008 has changed his policy to cope with the new, what is called like a new world. In this regard actually, instead of seeing the recession as a bad factor, we look to it as something good for us, for the future, for planning. We can summarize them in, for example, in production time, in competition with others, in the type of productivity of the deliverables. So we have looked into this matter and one of the best solutions which we found is to go into new softwares. During my past career, actually, I have worked also in different areas, in management and technical side, and when I joined Seferini as a director of operation, one of the main the main aim was is to look for the future. I also suggested so many things to the higher uh, administration, and they agree to what one of these things is to go for Archie. Actually, ArchiCAD as a tool for what is called BIM, Building Information Modeling. I have the belief that it is one of the best, if not the best. We have started this since two years almost, and we have implemented this software in two big projects regarding hospitals, which is 400 bit hospitals of around 70,000 square meters, it is a huge project. Hospitals usually is equivalent to all other types of buildings regarding the services, the structure and the architecture, the exterior design, the landscape, whatever it is. One of the important things that it is time saving, which I can say it can save not less than 30% of the time. This is number one. Number two, the type of productivity of the deliverables, where mistakes between different types of drawings like plans, elevations and sections is almost totally eliminated because there is a property of this software that whenever you do change in some type, the other types are automatically changed. Also cost-wise, this it means the cost of productivity for me is this so that can, I can compete with my prices to those whom I am offering my services. There is now a tendency from government side, from big projects, project developers also, there is a tendency to use BIM because they know that when they see something, they see it as if it is actual before it is actual. And this actually gives them the impression to go ahead and to proceed with other projects. But still, it is not as expected or as required. I hope that in the region it will be implemented by consultants, by contractors, by authorities even, as the case now in Abu Dhabi, is they are going to use this. And we are planning to work with them also using the same. Uh, my advice to those who are going to use BIM, point number one is that they should have the confidence that this software is really beneficial. There, there are benefits of that, number one. Number two, they must give the support to workers in this field. And number three, 
is that they should also dedicate separate teams with separate tools, especially the IT. And I think in this regard they can succeed and get a very good results in a very short time.